In this video, we are going to see about pressure switch basics. What is a pressure switch? Pressure switch is a mechanical or electronic device used to detect the process pressure and energizes an electric circuit when the pressure has reached its set point. Pressure switches are available to detect absolute, compound, gauge, and differential pressures. Sensing elements used in pressure switch are bellows, blunt tube, diaphragms, or other elastic sensors. Pressure switch operation The pressure on the diaphragm compresses a calibrated spring. The spring is the opposing force to the inlet pressure and the spring's pretension, which is adjusted with a set screw or knob. The spring pretension directly correlates to the pressure at which the switch makes an electric contact. When the pressure, spring tension, reaches or exceeds the set point, switch moves the contacts from open to closed position in ANO switch, or closed to open position in UNC switch. When the pressure drops, the switch resets to its original state. Types of pressure switch Diaphragm design and piston design. Diaphragm design is used for low pressure and vacuum applications. Piston design is used for high pressure applications. Terminology is used in pressure switch. Adjustable range is the pressure range within which the actuation point can be set. For example, we will see a pressure switch which detects pressure increase. Set point is the pressure that actuates the switch to open or close an electric circuit. Reactuation point is the pressure at which the switch resets to its original position. Dead band is the difference between set point and reactuation point. The set point accuracy defines the band within which repetitive actuations will occur. Tolerance is the repeatable accuracy of the reactuation point. For greatest accuracy, the set point should fall in the upper half of the range, but for a most favorable life factor, it should be in the lower half. The usually acceptable compromise is to locate the set point in the middle third of the range. Thanks for watching this video. For more videos like this, subscribe to Simple Science.